Privit and greetings from Odessa, Ukraine. So in today's video, I'm going to give you five reasons that smart, single and streetwise Western men should move to Ukraine. Now, some of these reasons are going to be equally applicable to other parts of Eastern Europe like Belarus and Russia. Some of them, not so much, but I'm going to explain to you why you should be moving to this country here, Ukraine. By Italy. So you can probably see that well, was my idea to show you the couple behind me. Um, and that brings us into our first reason why smart, single Western guys come here to Ukraine. That's because basically the dating options are going to be probably three times bigger than where you currently are in the West in terms of, well, basically I have a lot of content on this, of course, on this channel, go check it out if you're new here, but there's just an absolute overkill of beautiful women in Eastern Europe. Now, of course, that comes with some caveats. You have to understand the culture. There are a lot of pitfalls that Western guys fall into. But as long as you have a strategy and you know how to avoid those, then you are going to be amazed by your dating options. It's going to be so much better than in your hometown. So another Thing, continue on with the theme of 3xing your lifestyle at least is the cost of living. You can literally live a lifestyle that is a minimum of three times as high here in Ukraine than back in the West. So say that'll obviously change if you're living in a place like London or New York or Paris. It's going to be a lot more than 3xing. It's probably going to be minimum 5xing. Now that's not to say that you can come and work in a normal job in Ukraine and expect to get paid a Western salary, that doesn't happen. It is extremely attractive for guys who obviously are able to manage their business or their investments remotely or have some sort of maybe very nice expat package, very lucrative one, though they're pretty rare to come across nowadays. Or maybe you're retiring, then this is obviously a great place in terms of the value of money in order to do that. So basically imagine whatever lifestyle you have now and minimum three exit, definitely cost of living it's hard to rival it in Europe at the moment. So another thing that I really appreciate as I walk around here, how safe I feel. Now I'm not going to exaggerate and say that there's no crime in Ukraine. There is. Some of it affects uh, travelers, foreign visitors, but in general I actually feel safer here than I do for sure in Western Europe, for sure in Ireland where I was born after the pubs closed and people are drunk and violent. I just don't get affected by that as much here in Ukraine. Now there has been some issues at times with foreigners been targeted by gangs, but I would say that it's less than in the West. Definitely feeling safe on the streets in spite of what you might read in the media. There is of course a military conflict still in the east of the country, but you're going to be in Kiev, Lviv, Odessa most likely, and there you will not be affected by that whatsoever. So definitely for safety, another factor why you should move here. So I just finished that clip and then I realized I left out one important point, which is that you do have to be careful and it is the biggest, shall we say, petty crime issue in Ukraine and that is romance scams, of course, being targeted either online or in person here by girls who are just out to basically rob your money. This happens, I of course have a lot of content on that, I have other boot camps and how to deal with that issue, but that is probably going to be your biggest issue when you move to Ukraine and that is something that you need to get sorted obviously straight away. But once you have that down and a good strategy in place and you avoid those kind of traps then, 
good to go. So biggest danger is probably having your heart broken by one of those Ukrainian beauties. So looking out there, you can see the skyline of Odessa. A little bit of a cloudy evening. The sun just went behind those clouds over there. But another thing that you should consider in terms of moving here or spending a lot of time here, especially if you're streetwise and have good business acumen, is the huge opportunities. Because unlike in the West, where most ideas are already saturated, or you have to come up with the next big new thing in order to make a good investment decision and grow business, there are a lot of things that have already been validated in the West business-wise that have not been implemented in an economy like Ukraine. Uh, the investment environment has improved dramatically in say the last decade here. Rule of law is improving, the cost of labor is great value here. So maybe your idea is a cool hipster cafe or bar or maybe something more technical like IT outsourcing in the growing startup scene. Whatever it is, Ukraine may be your land of opportunity. And fifth and lastly, I would say that there is a feeling of freedom that I experience here that I don't currently feel in other parts of the West. It's kind of a mixture of things. I think regulation tends to, tends to be a little bit lighter here than you're going to see in North America and Western Europe. And also, if you are set up uh, to have your business manage it remotely, then living here, yeah, you definitely get that sense of freedom, not the big brother mentality. Obviously, things like political correctness are not gone mad in this part of the world. And you can live in your own community here, find like-minded guys who are also uh, either local who have the same mentality, having traveled and living abroad, or other foreigners who are based here. So I think this is why smart, single, streetwise Western men should move to Ukraine. Ooh, it is a warm, afternoon here in Odessa. Another thing that I forgot to mention, sometimes maybe for a lot of guys out there in the West, if you don't live in the best climate, then southern Ukraine is a lot more attractive in the summer for sure in terms of the weather. And that is a nice segue into what I've been working on over the last few weeks. And that is my new online consulting group, high level guys joining together who are planning to spend three to 12 months in Ukraine. We've been delving deep into a lot of the issues like with visas, why you should move, the benefits. I'll give you a little bit of overview of that in this video. Also, how you're gonna integrate here. Also, you know, how to network, building that um, stream of contacts that are gonna give you huge opportunities. Obviously, we're gonna dive into real estate because that is one of the big attractive things about moving here to Ukraine, as well as the medical system and what you need to know to be set up. So basically the idea is that we pool all our resources and we are all able to help each other, not just my knowledge and experience over the last 10 years of being here, but also the other guys who are planning to move and their individual experiences. So far, it's been absolutely incredible in terms of the value that I see in our live streams that we have once a week. So planning to open it again sometime in the future. I will only open it to my most loyal fans, like this time, they are the guys who are on my free mailing list. So if you're not on that, it's a bit of a no-brainer. Go below, there is a link. You click on that, you type in your email, then you're on the list once you confirm your email address. And as a free gift, I will give you my guide actually to my favorite places in cities like Kiev and Odessa. Also, I've actually got mints thrown in there as well. If you are considering to go to Belarus, that's another thing to think about, which you should, it's also Belarus is an interesting place. Beautiful Belarus. Can't wait to get back there sometime soon. So from a little bit of a warm, balmy evening in Odessa, Ukraine, Disvedanya, Dopobachnya. See you very soon. Maybe even here in Ukraine itself. Ciao, ciao. Sar experience.